Aloha and welcome to Kim's cooking show. My name is Kimberly Oshita and I'm a senior in the dietetics program at the University of Hawaii at Manoa. Today I'm going to show you how to make ono with the tzatziki sauce. This recipe is quick and easy to follow, but it does take a little bit of advanced preparation. So for the best results, you might want to plan a few hours ahead. Just to remind you, it's always a good idea to wash your hands before, before preparing any sort of food. Proper hand washing should take about 20 seconds. So now that I've just washed my hands, let's begin cooking. Besides the ono filet, you will need half a cup of Greek yogurt, half a tablespoon of lemon juice, one small garlic clove minced, a quarter cucumber peeled, a quarter tablespoon salt, one teaspoon fresh dill, and also a little more salt and some black pepper to taste. So right now you can set the onofile aside while we make the tzatziki sauce. First we're going to de-seed the cucumber. So you take your cucumber, you take your cucumber, you cut it in half lengthwise. We're gonna de-seed it with a spoon. After we've done that, you want to dice it into cubes that are approximately a quarter of an inch. Once you've done that, you can put the cucumber cubes into a bowl and you want to take the salt and sprinkle it over the cucumber. This will help to draw the water out. So you're going to cover this bowl and let it sit for 30 minutes. So once the cucumber has sat for a half hour, you want to go over the sink and rinse and drain it well. And then after you're done rinsing it, you want to make sure the cucumbers are fairly dry. In the food processor or blender, add in the cucumbers. lemon juice, fresh dill, and just a little bit of black pepper. You want to process until everything is mixed well. Once everything is mixed in pretty well, you're going to stir in the Greek yogurt. So you want to get a bowl, put everything in that you processed, and then mix that in with the Greek yogurt. Instead of salt, you could try adding in a little bit extra lemon juice if you're looking for more flavor without the sodium. So once the sauce is ready, you can place it in the refrigerator for at least two hours so that the flavors can develop. One serving of the tzatziki sauce is about 30 grams, contains 5 calories, no fat, about 1 gram of carbohydrate, and half a gram of sugar. So now that the sauce is ready, it's time to cook the ono. First you want to get a pan, as I've already coated it in some oil. You want to heat the pan to a medium-high heat, and wait a little while so that the pan is heated before you put the ono in. Now that this pan is heated, I'm going to put the ono in it. Because ono is such a lean fish, you want to make sure that you don't overcook it. You want to cook it for about 6 to 8 minutes, minutes per square inch on each side. So while we're waiting for the fish to cook, let me share some facts with you about ono. It is known as wahoo in North America and it is a saltwater whitefish. A 4 ounce serving of ono contains about 110 calories, 28 grams of protein, 1 gram of fat, and no saturated fat. 
so this makes it a really great source of high quality lean protein. Ono is also rich in vitamins and minerals such as niacin, B12, B6, phosphorus and selenium and it provides about 375 milligrams of omega-3s. Here I have some fresh greens, some Okinawan sweet potato and tomatoes from the North Shore of Oahu. So I'm going to take my sauce and drizzle it over the fish. And there you go. Thanks for watching and welcome to you.